Hi my lovies, thank you for watching. I'm gonna show you the tutorial of this makeup here. It's a dark and dramatic brown smokey eye with some shimmer in warm and cold tones and nude lipstick. For this look I used the contour technique what's in my previous video. I used cream products in my face. I hope you like it and let's begin. Here is me without any makeup on. I already applied my moisturizer and now I will start applying my primer. This one is Professional by Benefit, but you can use any primer that you like. I love this one because minimize any pores and lines in my face. With my beauty blender, I'm gonna apply the foundation. This one is Forever by Dior, but I apply just a little bit because after I will be doing the contour. So I don't want a lot of products in my face. Now I'm gonna apply the concealer, this one is Vanilla by NARS. I'm gonna apply and blend with my beauty blender to make my eyes look more awake. This is my favorite concealer at the moment. I know this concealer is much lighter than my skin, but I love it. And it looks so natural when you blend it with the beauty blender, because the beauty blender removes all the excess of the product. So I already told before, my beauty blender is my favorite tool of makeup. Now I'm gonna fill in my eyebrows using the Deep Brow Pomade by Anastasia Beverly Hills. I will mix these two colors together, the color blonde and chocolate, and this will create the perfect color for my eyebrows. So here's the difference, one eyebrow already finished and the another I'm gonna do with you. I'm gonna start with the blonde deep brow and a small angled brush. I'm gonna fill in my eyebrows with this, not just in the front, I'm gonna do it in all the eyebrow. And then with another brush in the color chocolate, I'm gonna give more dimension in my eyebrows and apply it in the middle to the end. Also, I'm gonna apply it in the bottom part of my eyebrow, leaving the front and the top part lighter for a natural effect. If we don't have eyebrows, we create it. What I most love in this deep brow pomade by Anastasia is that this product is waterproof. So once it dries, the eyebrows is yours because it also lasts so longer. You don't need to apply a lot of product as I'm doing here, but I'm trying to do my eyebrows thicker than they are. So this is optional, you can do your eyebrows as you like. And then now I have my brows. I'm gonna just fix everything in the place with this clear brow gel by Anastasia. I've just brushed my brows with this and this will make all my hairs stay in the place. Moving on to the eyes, I'm gonna apply my primer potion by Urban Decay. With a concealer brush, I'm gonna spread it all over my lid. This will make the colors more vibrant and help the shadows to keep in the place all the day. Also, I'm gonna apply in my tear duct area and in my lower lash line. Now using one of my favorite palettes, the Full Exposure by Smashbox, I will start applying this lighter shade in my tear duct area and also below of my brow. Now with a fluffy brush, I'm gonna apply this light warm brown eyeshadow in my crease, in my outer corner and also in my lower lash line. This eyeshadow will just help to blend the next color, so go ahead in a little at the time and blend really well. All over my lid and my lower lash line, I'm gonna apply this deep brow pomade in the color Auburn with this eyeshadow brush. It will help the makeup to last so longer. I love it because it is a warm shade of brown. And the fun part of the deep brow is that you can use it also as eyeliner, but today I'm using as a shadow base. And then I will change the brush and blend the edges of this deep brow before it dries.
Now with a normal eyeshadow brush, I'm gonna just apply this dark brown eyeshadow in my outer corner and in my crease. It will create more depth in the makeup and also it will help to blend the edges of the deep brow. And I apply this eyeshadow also in my lower lash line. It will create a beautiful effect. I back again with my first blending brush and without apply any product I just blend the edges again and again till I feel that it's okay. Now I'm gonna apply this beautiful pigment by MAC. I don't know what is this color, but it's so awesome. I think this is the Misty Season Cool. And I'm gonna apply this color where I left it without a shadow. This will create a beautiful contrast in the makeup. If you don't have it, you can use any similar color or even a gold or silver. Finally, I'm gonna line my eyes with my Wicked Gel Eyeliner by Sigma Beauty in this small angled brush. It is also by Sigma and is my favorite eyeliner brush. Then you can go ahead and apply your mascara and fake lashes. My previous video is about this contour technique. And now I'm gonna just highlight my face using this champagne shade. This color is stunning for highlight my face. And finally, I'm gonna apply my lipstick to finish this makeup. This liquid lipstick dries matte and is also by Anastasia Beverly Hills. This is my favorite shade in Pure Hollywood. So that's it, I hope you enjoyed this tutorial, thank you so much for watching my babies. Please don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more news and follow me on Instagram, I just changed it for Melissa Sunways. I hope this video can help you and I see you soon, bye!